Accredited land consultants Grant Massey formed the Grant Massey Land Network to help educate the public about land issues. The topic of this series is timber as an asset and timberland as an important part of an investment portfolio. Logs are determined to be saw timber, chip and saw, or pulpwood based on their DBH or diameter at breast height. DBH is a standard of measurement for the industry, about four and a half feet above the ground. Saw timber is usually the larger trees. Diameter-wise, it's going to be 12 uh, inches uh, diameter breast height, DBH. With pine trees, saw timber is considered the most valuable since boards and veneers can be cut from it. Trees that are about 8 to 10 inches DBH are considered chip and saw. Some boards are cut from the logs and the rest is chipped up to make wood fiber. Trees smaller than 8 inches DBH are considered pulpwood. Since they are too small for boards, they are chipped up for wood fiber. On the hardwood pulpwood side of things, diameter can vary and it's based on the quality of, of the hardwoods, if it's spirally or, or knotty or whatnot. It could go up to 12 inches and they'll chip that up for, for fiber. With hardwoods, the most value is found in good quality larger trees since layers of the wood called veneers can be peeled off. Veneers are used in the manufacture of furniture and other products, typically attached to particle board or other materials to create a wood finish. Join us for our next segment of Timber Talk for the factors that determine a quality timber stand.